Hi, I'm Joe Lighton, and I'd like to welcome you to the joy of programming. Today we're going to program a Piet Mondrian painting. Piet Mondrian, or in Dutch Piet Mondrian, was a Dutch painter who made abstract art with simple geometric elements. For this painting, we're going to need the programming language QuickBasic. Let's start the software. Because a painting is a graphic, we need to work in graphics mode. We pick graphics mode 12, also known as VGA mode. We want a random painting, so we set a randomized timer. There. Every human needs a friend, but every painting needs a background. For this, we want a big rectangle as a background. A rectangle from position 0 on the x-axis and 0 on the y-axis to 639 on the x-axis and 479 on the y-axis. We do this with the line command and use color code 15, which stands for bright white. I like this color. Reminds me of Aspen. Rolling in the snow and warming up in front of the fireplace. Drinking a tasty glass of Jägermeister. I really love my childhood. In college I discovered a new type of snow. But I prefer not to talk about that. Mondrian loved lines. And I love lines as well. Let's start with some vertical lines. We want vertical lines from the left to the right. For this I want Quick Basic to count to 640. We can do this with a for next statement. We call the counting variable A. We use some random magic with the RND command. There. Now we can draw the vertical lines. You know what? Let's be silly and do some horizontal lines as well. the statement with next A. As you can see, I added the random variable 4 to give the lines several thicknesses. Now it's time to add some primary colors in random positions. Like bright red. For this, we use the color code 12. What about some blue? Life would be boring without blue. For this we use the color code 1. Let's give those two colors a friend. Mondrian loved friends. Not the TV show. He would probably have preferred Seinfeld if he were still alive. Yellow. For yellow, we use the color code 14. And now, the most exciting moment, running the program. We can do this with the F5 button. Wow, beautiful. Bless you and thank you for watching the joy of programming.